I say bite. Yes, right, okay, right. Oh. My name, my name is Bertie. Uh, not, not the other Bertie. Bertie what is with uh, Jacob, not that Bertie. I am Bertie, Bertie, Bertie Bagwash. You may know me or you may not. Right, I, I've, I, I've got a mate who looks very much like me, uh, who, who uh, plays with his model railways on, on this uh, channel. And he let me, well he looks a bit like me, except I reckon I've got a nicer hair cut. So, he said to me, you're good at cooking, ain't you Bertie? So I said, well I'll cook a bit, don't I? He said, well, in these times of, of uh, being locked down, as it were, yeah, uh, he said, why don't you cook something and I'll put it on my channel for you. I said, well, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's very nice of you, thank you. I can't remember his name. Anyway, he's a nice bloke, isn't he? And uh, so, I mean, I've got a missus, got, got a wife, and I, I've got a son as well, who is the crew, okay? So, it, w would you like to come around here, son? If you twist the screen around, you can see yourself, can't you? I know you like doing that. Alright? Here he is. Is he a bit big for the screen? No, he's not, is he? Right. Oh, I'm Bertie. Bertie Bagwash. And this is Betsy. <laughs> <laughs> I know, we, we keep here. Yeah, people do laugh, don't they? But this is Betsy Bagwash. Um, uh, we've apologised to him a lot of times. But my, my missus, she wanted a girl, see, dead set on a girl. So she didn't think it would be that bad if she called him Betsy. I don't think he's quite got over it yet, have you, lad? No. Nah. Anyway, what he's doing is sitting behind a camera. Well, he's not at the moment, is he? No. So, uh, oh yeah, my missus, yeah, uh, Nausea. Her name is Nausea. Nausea Bagwash. She's very nice. Yeah, uh, and um, I say we're we're a lockdown at the moment, aren't we? So, well, for me, you're a lockdown. For me, it's I, I'm more like locked in, because nausea locks me in my room for most of the day, because she said she's getting a bit pissed off <laughs> with me. I don't know why. Anyway, we're going to make some cooking. Okay. I'm the cooker. So you go behind the camera, right, and listen, son, because you might learn something, okay? Right. So what we got, what am I making? It's one of those, uh, like a pizza thing, but it's not pizza. What's it called? A flamin cooking. Flamin cooking. Right, okay. Right, I like that. And so I'm going to show you dead easy. Dead easy. I'm going to show you how to make it, alright? So first off, you need a bowl. Right, I've got a bowl. And then you need some scales. Now these scales are in grooms and cugs. Alright? I didn't grow up with grooms or cugs, but I have to use them now. So what we want is some ordinary flour. Right, flour. We need, for each person, I'd say we need about 150 grooms. Okay, 150 grooms for each person. So I'm going to make this for just me and uh, Betsy, alright? Uh, so that's, how many grooms is that, Bet? 300? Yes. He's a bit slow with his thumbs. Uh, right, so 300 grooms, right, of ordinary flour, that goes in, all right, lumps and all, don't matter, what did I say, 300, my memory's not what it used to be, son, right, that's 290, so we need some more, don't we, 
292 300 300 yeah that'll do right 300 grams right that's us there so we put some salt in you like salt don't you put a bit of salt in right I'll tell you what I like in it as well I like some garlic and we've got some garlic just uh, in the uh, freezer. We'll leave it on it. It's a little packet. Frozen garlicky bits. Alright. We'll just put a few of them in. Yep. Actually, I do quite like it, so we'll put a bit more. Right, back in the freezer with that. See that? Can you see it? Yeah? Yep. Right, it's ale koopy. Ale koopy. Good stuff, eh? That's garlic in French, ale koopy. I was like, they be French. I know, I know. Right. So we got that in, haven't we? So what we've got to do is put, should we get a spoon out? I'll get a spoon out. Sort of turn it around a bit like that. So that's a flour, a bit of salt, al kubi, garlic to you English people. And uh, now we need some water. Add some olive oil. Alright? So we need off that's off the weight alright of water so what I'll do is this is the uh, olive oil alright right, so I'll just splash just a splash alright in there so that's 20 grooms 20 grooms of olive oil and then we need some water so what we got in 300 grams of flour, so what's half of that, Betsy? 150. God, you quick off the mark there. Right, so we'll make that up to 150, all right? Keep your eye on it, because it goes flying up, doesn't it? What's making me want to go to the toilet? Right. Oh. Right. Right, I thought I was a Cornishman then for a minute, didn't we? That. Right, so what we need to do is to kind of mix that up a bit, yeah? So mix it up, don't make a much mess like I do. Let's mix it. Don't put any more water in it. Right, or get too wet on it. So kind of like mix it up with a, with a spoon. Right, Sad? Fine. Good. Good, right? We're kind of... It's like that at the moment. Brilliant, eh? So it's kind of like pastry, except you have to knead it a bit, yeah? It's not quite like bread, so you don't have to do it that hard. But, like pastry. So that when you roll it out, because that's what I do, I roll it out, see? Ah, right, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to let that rest a bit, yeah? I think I'm going to have a rest as well, actually. So need to left, leave it rest. We just cover it up with a kind of cloth or something. Just put it over there for five minutes, ten minutes, whatever. All right. Not like bread, you don't have to let it rise. And then, what we'll do is we'll roll it out and then put the chopping on it. Right, I'll be back in about five then. See ya. Watch me. Right then? Yeah, let them roll. Yeah. Right, I'm on the next bit, eh? <laughs> I'll tell you what, it's like that bloke got a telly, innit? What's his name? Rick Stein, eh? Eat your heart out, mate. This is the way to do a Flat, uh, whatever it is, 
Fermi thing. Right, okay, so what we're doing now, apart from shedding hair everywhere, I should be should be wearing a hair net, shouldn't I really? Yeah, but, uh, roll it out, roll it out, put it on a tray, right, what we've got here. That's a pizza tray, that. It's got holes in it. So you roll it out and put it on that, all right? So we're nearly finished. Not exactly round, is it? I suppose it's about, what, 12 inches? 12 inches across there? What do you think, Betsy? Got to be I about 12 so. inches, isn't it, eh? Yeah. But I think Betsy's a bit of a millimetre person. So uh, confusing, I think, isn't it? Inches. Right. So we've got it there, haven't we? All right. So what do we do now? Smack our hands together and get a fridge. Right there. What we want? Can you see it, son? Yep. Okay, it's uh, called Creamy Fridge. Creamy Fridge. Okay, so it's like, uh, I suppose a bit like creme fraiche really, isn't it? Uh, as organised as I am, let's see, I ain't got a spoon. You could just go and get your spoon. Because I want to put some of this creamy fresh on uh, me, uh, me bottom. All right. So we'll, we'll dock that out, yeah, spin it around a bit. That looks nice, doesn't it, eh? Right. Take it out, a bit more than you would on the old uh, tomato for the pizza. A bit more, a bit thicker, eh? Than the old uh, tomato. Right, so... I'm sure we don't get that in the eyeball, eh? Right. Put that down there. Then what we need is some of that stuff there, which is a uh, Jambon Crew Thum. A. A. Which is smoked raw bacon. It's quite thin, actually. Could you see? Look, dead thin. All right. So I put some of that on, kind of sprinkle it about a bit. Right. Try not to put it flat like what I've done. Kind of ruck it up a bit, yeah? Right. Just put some of that on. I like, I like this, it's nice and stuff. Um, I'll put a bit more on, shall I? Yeah. Right, that's that. Right, I'm just going to whisper to the cameraman that I've forgotten the onion. I've forgotten the onion. Oh, uh, right, so switch it off for a minute, I'll go and get the onion. Right, oh, okay, so you crank it up again. Right, here we go. Got the onion. Cut up into kind of uh, rings, yeah? Rings and things. We'll just put those on top, should we? Like a nice bit of onion. Nothing like a nice bit of onion. So we'll sort of sprinkle those about. You can put on a lot or a little, I suppose. Over there. Put on some sh shallots. Those little small onions. Whatever. I don't know. I like a lot of onion. As you can probably tell. I like onion. Right. Onion. Right, we've got enough onion on there, I think. Right. And we need some cheese, don't we? Hey, we need some cheese. Oh, that's nice. That's onion, that. <laughs> right, we'll get some cheese. Oh, 
right. So this is uh, this is wrapped. Uh, wrapped. Was it wrappy? It's uh, cheese. What's been uh, thingy? Get it. Go eat your heart out, Rick Stone. That's nice. Right. Well, we've got that. I'll tell you what we'll do. We don't want any salt because we've got the ham. That's got salt in it. And uh, cheese has got a bit of salt in it. But we'll do with a bit of pepper. A bit of a melange mixture. Yeah. Nice bit of pepper. If you like pepper. That's it. And then what we'll do is we'll slap that in the oven at 220 or 230 degrees centigrade for nine minutes. And we'll take it out and have a look, shall we? Here we go then. Right. Right, wait for nine minutes. What should we do then, Betsy? Do I switch it off? Or you keep it. Okay. Right. Well, that was that was a uh, quick nine minutes, wasn't it? Eh? <laughs> uh, right. Uh, it's nine minutes, and it's at the oven. I reckon. I reckon that looks lovely, me. That really does. Don't matter that you ain't got that smoked bacon. Just used a bit of ham. Got onion, that's right. You can make a bit of to put a bit whatever cheese you want. A cheddar or something like that. Great idea. With a creme fresh. What's it took? It ain't took very long, has it? And I'll tell you what, that tastes brilliant. Uh, we'll be doing a few more, I reckon. What do you think, Betsy? Do you reckon we ought to make a few more of these videos? Yes, yeah. We do some Yorkshire puddings or something like that, eh? I reckon that would be good, that. Well, I'll tell you what. If this video don't get us 35 fat... Well, I reckon, don't you? 35,000? 35,000 yeah. views? Yeah. I think you need to come a bit closer, Betsy. I know your name's better. I don't buy it. Right, I won't buy it. Right, anyway, it's uh, time to sign off. It's goodbye from uh, uh, Nausea Bagwash. She ain't here at the moment. So, uh, anyway, she says goodbye. Goodbye from me, Bertie Bagwash. And uh, it's goodbye from... Uh, Bessie Backwash. Betsy. But I forgot your name, son. Oh, yeah, Betsy. Oh, sorry. Betsy Backwash. No problem. Yeah, right. Anyway, see you next time, mate. Look after yourselves. Get yourself looked in. And uh, don't fall over. Bye.